So my research looks at the, uh, the ways in which schools affect student performance and in particularly focuses on the differences between the importance of school quality and school fit. And when we think about schools, we might think about schools varying in their academic quality. Um, so the types of inputs that are in a school, whether students, the peers that students are exposed to, the quality of teachers and the resources that are at the school. And we might think this impacts how schools, students perform. Uh, but there's also the dimension of school fit. We might think that students uh, might benefit from being in an environment that they like. So being in a school that has the types of characteristics they like, whether it's the size, the location, um, religious affiliation, or things like that. My research focuses on secondary schooling in Ghana. So I track a set of ninth year students as they transition into the last three years of high school and look at how uh, the type of school they get assigned to affects their performance in secondary school. So students in the year that I'm studying, 2005, are able to uh, list a set of three choices in order of preferences, and then they take a national exam. And they, the schools declare how many vacancies they have available in that year, and students get assigned to a school based on their performance on this national exam. My study measures school quality using the average test scores of students assigned to a given school, and measures school fit using the similarity between the characteristics of a student's assigned school and the choices that they selected. I find that both school quality and school fit make students more likely to stay in the same school until the end of secondary school. However, I find that students that are assigned to a school with better quality are more likely to uh, have higher performance on the secondary school exit exam. The main takeaways of my research for government policy is that if governments are interested in increasing student learning, then they should perhaps focus on providing parents and students with more information on the academic quality of different schools so that students can make more informed choices. Additionally, if, schools, if governments are interested in uh, investing or thinking about how best to invest scarce resources, then perhaps they should focus on improving the quality of existing schools or expanding access to high quality schools rather than focusing resources on expanding the range of available attributes. Beyond just thinking about the ways in which school quality affects student performance, there's a broader sense in which we can understand how schools impact student outcomes. And that's by studying other ways in which school fit, the link between uh, student preferences and, and um, the type of school they're in, essentially whether a student likes the school they're in, uh, we can understand how that affects things beyond just student performance, but looking at things like their life outcomes, their social-emotional skills, and other behaviors.